Can you hear me now? Oh, maybe that one will work. Can you hear me now? I'm going to try one other. Maybe you can hear me now because I see stuff going by. Okay. Let me see. Can you hear me now? Can you hear now? Okay. I see Pink Rose said yes. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> <clears throat> Yay! <laughs> we have picture. We have sound. We have people. <laughs> All righty. <laughs> So, hello, Christy, and Sandra, and Tammy, and Pink Rose, and Leslie, and Julie, and Naomi, and Beverly. Hello, Beverly, and myself, <laughs> and Austin. Hey, Austin, and Robin Stapp, and Lisa, and Fluke, and let's see, Joe. Hey, Joe. <clears throat> Kathy can hear me. Yay, Giovanna. Yay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> now you can, Lisa. Awesome. Okay, now you can. Now you can. Now you can. Awesome. Yay, yay, yay. Hello, Paper Puddles. You were able to finally change your name, Carrie. That's awesome. Hey, Elijah. Hi, buddy. How are you? <laughs> All right. Hello, darling. <laughs> Hey, Ellen. So glad to see you. All right. So, wow, y'all. It's been busy. <clears throat> um, refresh. Somebody type refresh. Refresh. And then you should. Okay. Oh, hey, Jaden and Autumn in the back seat of Austin's car. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, thank you, Beverly. <laughs> thank you, Faluke, for saying that. <clears throat> All right, so I have lots to show y'all. So let's get started here. So let me kind of get piles going. First, I'm going to show you some happy mail that I got. Uh, Deborah Carver sent me a package and I thought this was super super sweet of her she subscribed to the Bella Rose subscription box and she got her box on the 21st of February and I got this Saturday I think it was I think it was Saturday and so she says I received my order yesterday my heart Leapt for joy, and I don't know, maybe she said wept for joy, not only for my order, pretty fibers always make me melt, but also for the kindness you've shown in trying to help me out with the purchase, and mostly for the sweet additions to the order. When I opened the pink package is when I almost lost it. I immediately went to my craft room, and the ideas flooded. My mind, I wanted to use everything. I wanted to hoard everything. I was going nuts, lol. Here is the thank you that I came up with. It was so much fun. I just wanted to thank you for being you, your friend, Deborah Carver. I thought that was really sweet. All right, did I say hi to everybody? Pink Rose and everybody, Paper Puddles. Hey, Roz! <clears throat> and so she made, out of the kit from the Bella Rose kit, and I'll tell you some things that she used from the kit. She used the lace from the kit. She used the sequins from the kit. This flower is from the kit. This background paper is from the kit. This rose is from the kit. And she used a bulb pen from the kit. Look how she put the beads on the bulb pen. Y'all see that? Hey, perfectly and perfect crafts. And then she added charms to this little chain. Isn't that super cute? I love how it turned out. What do you think of that? Isn't that gorgeous? I, it just makes me happy. So I'm like, oh, and then she recycled the envelope that I sent to her with the goodies. She put that back in it and sent it to me. And I thought that was really sweet. 
So thank you, thank you, thank you, Deborah. I'll post this online uh, on my Facebook page as well. Henry's there. Yay! I know that Henry's staying busy. He's got work to do. and You can only see yours, Julie. Try refreshing, Julie. There are other people's commenting, so refresh. Thank you. I thought she did a fabulous job, and I just had to share. Just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous work. I'll set that aside. <clears throat> and then uh, Christine, yeah, Christine from Australia sent me a package. I pulled this out because it was folded and I didn't want it to be um, smooshed or creased. And what she's done here, it looks like these are pages out of a journal. They're uh, gesso canvas pages if you will and she's kind of done some mixed media stuff on them she sewed it shut and it's funny because i unstitched this by hand on this side and i probably could have just cut the tape and folded it but i did it <laughs> so i thought it was really cool she kind of collaged on it and i don't mind about my address y'all that's if y'all ever want to send me something that's where you can send it that's our business address and so she sent this really pretty butterfly stencil. I thought that was gorgeous. She sent some little um, sleeves, like for artist trading cards. And then this is a little envelope that she sent. And then she sent this really cute postcard. Look at the little naked boy. <laughs> and it's an old photograph looking thing. It's from Australia. I thought that was really cool. Hey, Norella, so glad you're here. And then I thought this was neat. A neat postcard that she sent. And then she made envelopes. So this is a map. And it looks like she kind of painted over a book page. Maybe music. It looks like music. And then she stitched it down. And it's really cute. So there's a little envelope that you could put goodies in. And then here's another one. She stitched around the edges. The same thing. Music on this part. I'll turn it this way. Music on this part. So you can put things inside. And that's not even decorating. That's just leaving it like that. Hey, Julie, you can hear and you can see. Yay! And then look at this one. Um, I think it's called, what did I see? I saw it somewhere. Um, imp impressionism, post-impressionism. The snake charmer. 1907. So I don't know if you can see that there's someone in there trying to charm the snake. And you see the snake coming here and you can kind of see him coming up and there's one wrapped around her. <clears throat> and then here's another postcard. And this one is Impressionism, Post-Impressionism, The Flowery Bearer. The Flower Bearer. I don't know. So, yeah, Flowery Bearer. So I thought that was kind of cool. And here's another envelope that she made with that canvas paper. It's got a really cool texture to it. So I just wanted to share that as well. Oopsie, I'm about to lose everything. Put it back inside. Set this aside to look at later, use later. So I turn around. Um, this is what I made on the YouTube, the Facebook Live Thursday because YouTube did not want to cooperate. Um, this is the journal that I made during the live. I'm going to flip through it. And if this is something y'all want me to also include in the raffle today, if we get to, um, let's say, let's get to at least $75 today on donations. And then I will also put this in the raffle for the donated uh, givers today. Donate givers. How do I say that? Donations today. Those who donate. So this was part of the add-on kit for Far East. And then here is some ephemera that was given to me. And I used a new stencil. This is part of my stencil club. Now this is the Far East charm kit. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then this was some ephemera that someone sent me. It's some manga. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Manga. And then here's some more little things that are from the kit. This was a page out of a dictionary. And then I used a calico collage journal page to make a pocket. And this is the other side of that pocket. And you use the 
element. This was a card that someone sent me. So this is what I made on Thursday of last week. And this is a new stencil that's part of my stencil club. I'll show the stencils here again in a little bit. <clears throat> the weather has been cold and windy here. A lot of junk in the air, so I, I've been taking allergy medicine. Here I use a piece of fabric to make a tab. And then I put a bulb pin and a tassel. Thank you, Naomi, for your donation. And then this is a, a belly band that was made with fabric and another image from the kit. And I just kind of tied a little bow there across the top. Yep, here's the Far East kit, Norella says. There's a link. This is the Bella Rose stamp. Thank you, Fluke, for your donation. And here is another journal card there. And then here, what I did was I sprayed on a dictionary page, and then I sprayed it again, a different color, on this little notebook paper. And then I used the savvy stitches to make it look like it's stitched to the page. This is one of the other stencils in my stencil club. Gotta make that rainbow deep man, the rainbow sheep dance. I can't get my words out. <laughs> <clears throat> More from the kit as well. This is a piece of washi paper. Thank you, Debbie, for your donation. Thank you so much. And then this is an add-on that I got from Calico Collage as well. I love the goldfish. Isn't the goldfish cool? On the, well, you can't see it. Debbie's sheepy was dancing away. Isn't that goldfish cool on there? I love it. This is a kit that I requested that Norella make back in 2017. She made it. I got the kit. I printed the kit, and then my mother died. And I was, you know, grief in dealing with that, so I didn't make the kit. I set it aside, and then, of course, life, because I pushed it aside, and I had to uh, find it to do for the live stream on Thursday. And I thought it was perfect timing. This was a page that someone gave me. Look at the Asian shoe. Can you imagine wearing those shoes? And then this is a piece of Femra. Who else? Did I miss anybody in there? I finally contacted someone um, with our internet. And Henry doesn't even know this. I got them to give me a refund for one month on my internet because of all the issues that we've had. There's supposed to be an engineer coming out today, <clears throat> hopefully to fix mine and my neighbor's issue. So I'm hoping that this will be good. I'm, I'm using my cell phone to connect. You would like this uh, goldfish here? Oh, thank you, Robin, for your donation. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ooh, an Austin Captain James Cook project kit that has a lot of awesome stuff in it from my high school years. Oh, that'll be fun, Julie. That'll be fun. That'll be fun. And then this was a card that someone gave to me in a swap. And on the back has all the information of who made it, where she was from, what she used. I thought that was kind of cool. So we're going to put that in here. So yeah, I'm glad I got a refund on my internet for the month anyway. <clears throat> Another little card. And then that's the last of the Far East. So this was one journal that I made. And then here was after I got off the video, I made this journal. So this is one of the journal pages and I trimmed it down. And then I used a black marker and run around the edge to um, make it a dark edge. Thank you, Christy, for your donation. Thank you so much. And then this was just a leftover piece. So you could put a little tuck spot there. And this was one of the journal pages and I just put it inside. And this is one of my new stencils that I have. And here is a pocket that I made and put a journal card in. There's another one that I put in there. That's from Calico Collage. I stamped the pages. I was going to do a lot of stamping. This is what it, it's just a little coin. But we were having internet issues, so I didn't get to do everything that I wanted to do live. This was a uh, Chinese to English page, dictionary page, and I put other stuff on top of it. $75. $75. And I think we'll get there because I haven't even gotten to the other journal that we're going to make today. 
So that's that journal, and then it goes. These go together, and this is a band that I got from Seven Gypsies a while back. It's not available anymore, but it gives you an idea that if you have um, a piece of ribbon and you want to use one of these buckles, you could buckle that together to fit onto a journal. It's stretchy. Some people said use uh, hair bands. You like that? <laughs> More won't hurt though. That is correct. Yay, $45 so far. That's awesome. So I just wanted to show the Far East journal. I'm going to set this aside. Hopefully I'll remember. It's when y'all ask, where's the journal? It's over there. <laughs> um, <coughs> pardon me. My allergies are killing me. Let me get a drink of water. Hey, Janet. So glad to have you here. We had a great workshop Saturday, didn't we, Janet? Dee Dee and uh, uh, Sally and Beverly was there. So this is a new stamp bundle that I have in my shop. It's butterflies, and you can buy them individually, so you don't have to buy them as a set of four. But if you want to buy them as a set, it's the best deal. So we've got this large collage stamp that is, oh, thank you so much, Carrie. That is four by four inches, so it's a nice deep red image. And then this is like a monarch butterfly that's like three inches by two inches, I think, something like that. Uh-oh, Calico Collage is having computer issues. <laughs> and Julie's got to go hang the washing. I need to put mine in the, the uh, dryer. <laughs> you, yeah, everybody liked that one, didn't they? They were listening. And then here is a little butterfly that's an inch and a quarter by an inch tall. And then there's a saying... If nothing ever changed, there would be no butterflies. So this whole set is normally, I have to write my list here, $39.55, and you can get it for $29.99 in my shop. <clears throat> so I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. Oh, thank you, Giovanna, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm glad that... I was able to get a few things done and uh, get things ready for you guys and gals to see. So are y'all ready for the, oh wait, let me show you one more thing. So Beverly is my stamp lady. You'll see Beverly S in the chat here. And that is the owner and creator of Beeline Designs. And she created these samples. I gotta take some photos so I can put them up on my website. And these are stamps that she offers. That I'm selling in my shop. I know I have the brick background and I have the shabby stitches here. I haven't added the window yet. She's supposed to get me that. Yes, I'm I'm working on that, Fluke. I am. I want a little bitty tiny postcard that I'll have in my shop. That's coming soon. And then this is a, another one of her stamped images and words. And this is kind of cool. She's got lots of texture. I don't know if you can see, these are little scraps of paper that she's painted, and she's used a variety of things, like an old envelope and scraps of paper, in order to make this card. And then Dee, on Saturday, Dee Dee really loved this rose stamp. So this is a stamp that I'll be adding to my shop soon. And then there's a little birdie. <clears throat> the birdie's already in my shop. So yay, yeah, I'm working on it. And then this one, okay, I have to show you this one. This is really cool. Pork chop. So this one is a stamp. Here's a lady stamp. She's got the teacup. She's got a little birdie, and it said missing you. And then look at this. So you take this card, and it's an easel card. So I don't know if you can see that when it's setting on the, oh, got to be careful, not bend it when it's setting on the table it sets up so you can look at the card and that really pretty and that's kind of a neat thing even though we're making journals a lot of people still make cards so you can put a card 
into your journal. Especially if you're gonna give it to someone, you could put something special in there. So I just wanted to show those off. I'll be taking some photos and then I'll be adding these rubber stamps to my shop soon as possible. Beverly's working away, slaving away, making the rubber stamps because she's going to be out of town. So if there's a rubber stamp that you wanted in my shop, if you're not ready to purchase but you're going to want it in the next three weeks, message me so I can tell her the order and maybe she can get it done <laughs> before she goes out of town. All right. <clears throat> you like the easel car? I used to make a bunch of those easel cards. Yeah, see, there you go, paper puddles. You can use those. All right, so this is the latest kit from myself and Calico Collage. I'm so glad, Beverly. I really enjoyed having you there. And it's called Outrageous Orange, and it features artwork that I created. So I created some gel prints. I created some hand-drawn art. I painted some lilies for it and then she used some of the designs I'm using for stencils as elements in the kit. So you're going to get a bottle of Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. It's exclusive to the kit. Did y'all notice my nails? Did y'all notice my nails? They're orange just because of this kit. And I got, I don't know if you can see the little design, but there's a little design on there. Hey Sandra! Then in the kit, you're also going to get an exclusive stencil that's only available in this kit. Do you like my stencil? I think it's gorgeous. I think it turned out really good. I'm going to put this back over here. Good morning, Sandra! Just so I can keep the things neat and out of the way. Then you're going to get all these papers. Oh, good. I'm so glad. So you're going to get this foiled paper and you're going to get some dictionary pages and some bible pages you're going to get a really pretty envelope uh, baggie there are different colors yes it is an orange kit it's orange <laughs> and then you're going to get a tag and you're going to get some uh, craft paper a little foil folder Let's see, we got some black card stock, white card stock, craft, a bookmark size. This one is chalk paper. Um, then we've got a watercolor paper, a couple of doilies. I love this paper. I thought that would be kind of fun to use. Watercolor paper, journaling card, some corrugated cardboard, a, um, what is that called? ATC size, a little baggie, and little tags. <clears throat> that you can decorate. Oh, good. I'm glad. I'm glad, Janet. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Yay. And then you'll get, but wait, there's more. <laughs> this is not a subscription box, Julie. This is called the Rainbow Creative Kit. And what I've done is I've set this up for those off months that people want to get another kit in the other month, they can go ahead and buy it. But if you don't want to be a subscriber, this is what that is. It's just a a la carte and you just order it when you want to order or until I run out. Okay. This is the rainbow one. So in here, we're going to get some fuzzy fibers, some eyelash kind of pinky color. This is a yarn. This is hemp cord. You're getting a yard of all of those. You're going to get a yard of lace. Isn't this pretty? Do you like that? Isn't that pretty? Ooh, yeah, it's not It's not in the subscription box. It's separate. <laughs> but you can order it. It's not a problem. And the same thing applies. This ships out on the 15th of the month. And you can order add-on items for no additional shipping. You can order them all at once. Or you can send me a message and I can send you an invoice. Um, you get a yard of core of uh, that gold, and then you get, I don't know how many inches of some canvas. And then this really bright orange envelope. So that comes with this kit as well. And I hope y'all that are getting these are um, having fun 
<laughs> a rainbow! The rainbow one! <laughs> That's funny, Elijah. <laughs> and the next subscription box, subscription box, this is not a subscription box. The next subscription box will be peacocks. So in here, you also, I'm supposed to be getting some more supplies. If they arrive, they'll be in your kit. <laughs> But <clears throat> you'll get some rhinestones. Look at these paper clips that I got this time. They're really cool and they're kind of a coppery rose gold. Those are paper clips, y'all. And then I got some rose gold. There's four of these total. Little bulb pins. And then I've got beads. There's a lot of little beads. So you can put a bead on a bulb pin. Yeah, start collecting to go with the peacock or to go with this orange one. You get a couple of random charms. Um, I don't know what they're going to be. They're all different because I ordered a big bulk thing of different ones. And then here's a little paper flower. And sequins, different sizes of sequins as well. All right, so let's see if I can get all of Woo! We got beads going everywhere. The beads are flying. All right, that's not going to work. I need a thinner piece of paper. Here we go. The thinner paper would work better because cardstock doesn't want to bend. All right. So let's do this. It's going everywhere. This is my um, prototype kit, if you will. I always make one and then it stays in my room the duration of the filming of stuff so I have all the goodies to show everybody. <laughs> oh, you have some orange gel plates. Cool. <clears throat> all right. Do you like those paper clips? Aren't they fun? All right. So this is one of the three pages of fussy cut elements that come in the kit. So that's the first one. I painted these flowers. That's my artwork there. And then the background here, do y'all recognize that? That's the stencil design. And I sent Norella gel prints. So she used my stencil design and the gel print. All right. You were cringing. You didn't want orange, Julie. <laughs> Ju is that your color? I think it's turned out gorgeous. I love the Monarch butterflies. That's why we added the butterfly bundles of availability. I love how she added the stencil design in here and used my gel prints for some of it. So what do you think of that? That's the fussy cut items. And then here's the journal that comes in the kit. And it has these pages inside and the inside cover. Now there are 12 pages and it's 100 pound card stock that is eight and a half by five and a half. Okay. And these are 100 pound card stock too. So they're heavy duty. So I'm going to set that aside over here and I'll show you two more things that are part of the outrageous orange. There is a mini kit and Norella, we have to do something because he printed it upside down again. This is just my sample. It will be done, uh, Oh, I got you, Julie. The the beads and the seeds going everywhere. Yeah, that would happen to me. Um, he printed it upside down. So disregard the direction, but these are the correct images. I don't know if you see this swirly in the background. I hand drew that and I uploaded it for Norella to use and she did. I thought that was really cool. So this is that design. I hand drew that. You like it, oh, Robin? Good perfect since you're a Tennessee girl and then here's the other cover there's two covers in this mini kit that makes a three and a half by five inch journal so it's perfect to fit inside your bigger journal or to have as a separate gift or something and then here's the next journal page and I guess this one isn't really upside down because there's no direction on here but some of the other pages were upside down <laughs> And then here's this page. I love the little birdie peeking out. And here's the other side. I love the postcard. She really tried to pick a lot of different orange flowers to get them all to go together. <clears throat> yeah, we got to figure something out. I don't know why he keeps having a problem with doing it upside down. 
Um, so here's the next one. And she chose to do, this is orange and Spanish. Is that correct? Norella, I forgot to write my notes, my notes down. Um, and then here's the other side of that page. And then here's the last page, the little birdie and the lilies. And then we go. So that's a mini journal that's available in the kit. And I just think they're really cute and fun. And I may figure out a way to use this even though it's um, upside down. <laughs> but this kit, he did correct. Thank you, Julie. Thank you. I and I I'm uploading right now all the artwork that um, for gel prints for the peacock kit. Ah, it's orange and Italian. Very good, Giovanna. Thank you. <laughs> so this is one of my gel prints that she used down the spine here, and then these are flowers that I painted, and I think this is a gel print of my stuff in the background. Isn't it gorgeous? I think it's beautiful, Carrie. I really like it. And then here's the back side. This is two card stocks. Yeah, it gives you lots of color, so you can do all kinds of stuff with it. Um, this is on 100% cardstock, and there's two covers, so that's one cover. Here's the second cover. It's just like the mini. And then these pages are printed correctly, so you can see those really fast. And then she made planner pages for this journal because the radiant red is also a planner. So we wanted to make this a planner. Okay, I thought it was. I thought she used a lot of my gel prints whenever you could anyway. She's she's amazing, y'all. You've got a she's got a couple of videos she shows how she does some of the artwork and I'm just sitting there going, I wouldn't have even thought to do the shading there, you know? So you're very very talented, Norella. This is a larger page. <clears throat> I love she revit. This is a dragonfly she's used in other kits, and it was perfect to put here. So, if you had the dragonfly delight, you could kind of mix it in and, you know, change the orange to a blended turquoise and orange. And then here she created a, a sewing machine. This is what we call the Easter egg in the kit, or one of the Easter eggs. She altered the name on the sewing machine itself digitally. Then she altered the verbiage and then added the flowers. And she called it Naranja because I, um, I, I always answer the phone when she calls me. Hola, como esta? <laughs> and she goes, uh, hello? <laughs> Aren't the graph lines cool too? I, they're all awesome. So anyhow, she decided to put a little Spanish into this one. I love the background on this one with the butterflies in it. See, so this could almost be fall if you wanted to save that page leading into Halloween. Yeah, I I believe so, Naomi. A lot of things just go to what go well together, and it's awesome. Go together well. See, my English is terrible, y'all. <laughs> so there are seven two-sided journal pages in the printed kit when i'm showing you this you can also get this as a digital download i haven't put up just the digital download yet but i do have it as part of the kit bundle i'll have the digital download portion opened up uh, tonight or tomorrow so you get six printed pages <clears throat> that are eight and a half by 11 on 100 pound, 100 pound card stock. Yeah, it would be good for autumn too, I agree. Yes, it could all be for March because of the green, because you've got the green in the uh, orange flowers. So this is one of the journal cards. Here's a fussy cut in the expanded kit. So you could get it printed or digitally, or both if you're getting all of it. Um, and they're the same images for the printed and the digital, okay? And then this one, look at all these pockets. Y'all were wanting um, some more tuck spots and pockets, and so she made a few extra. And then look at what she put, let me do it this way, on the back. I love that. Isn't that cool? 
Oh, hope it does, Julie. I hope so. Yes, the list and wisdom and the dragonfly de delight make a cool purple and blue journal. Oh, neat, Naomi. I like it. I need to see some photos of that. <laughs> Naomi says we need to change the dancing sheep to a dancing blonde lady. <laughs> That's funny. I love this tuck spot here that she made in the kit. Um, these are little elements that you can cut up. I don't know. These are just really cool. And remember when you buy a digital download, you can crop this. You can make it bigger. You can make it smaller. So remember you have a lot of flexibility. I love it. I love it. I love it. I, I just think it's awesome that she used the stuff that I created. Oh, no, I didn't see that. So I drew a sunflower. Um, I uploaded it as a drawing and she went in and added some color. So the orange design here is what I drew. And then she altered it. I didn't notice that, Norella. That's funny. So this is an add-on kit to the big kit. I hope I make that very clear. You don't have to buy it, but if you want, it's available. $14.99 for the printed kit when you order the Outrageous Orange. If you want it digitally, it's $10.99. So when you look at those prices, that's all added together. <clears throat> Henry says, hmm, give money to see the blonde dance. Sounds familiar. Okay, let's not go there. <laughs> You like the, the, with the black and the orange polka dots with the butterflies and birds. Uh, she always sends me a message that says, I don't know which one to do. See if you can, oh no, we're buffering. Um, see which one do you like? And then I'll send her a message say, oh, I got it. <laughs> I like that one. I like this one. And so that's what I sent to her was that. And I'm just rattling on because we're buffering. Are we buffering? All right. Hopefully it'll stop buffering. I am so tired of internet issues. <gasps> so it's, yeah, it's not only you. I'll give it a second. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start cutting up the ephemera while we're buffering. And if it keeps buffering, no, it's, it isn't me, Calico Collage says. Refresh, refresh everybody that's having buffering issues while I cut out some things. Sometimes Norella makes these really easy to um, cut with a paper cutter and sometimes she doesn't. <laughs> so I'm just going to do this. I'm going to go in here at least cut it out. I'm going to cut a few things up. Yeah, everybody says, I think it's YouTube is the issue with buffering because everything I read, it keeps doing. And then on to compound things, I was having internet issues. So I'm hoping that once my area fixes the internet issues, that everything else will just come together and work like it's supposed to. So we're going to make a journal. I'm going to use this cat to make the journal. I'll also show some stencils from the stencil club. In fact, I can lay those at least out so you can see them. So these are two stencils that are my new stencil club. Can you see those pretty good? So they're eight and a half by 11 stencils, perfect for the journals. That's already in my shop. Those are a stencil club monthly club. So every month you will get two new completely exclusive stencils that I created and you will also get with I gotta gotta remember to order a, to send an email to one lady you will get a coupon code that you can then get 20% off every additional stencil that you order I am adding more stencils to my shop I think I have like 20 stencils up there now and I hope to add about uh, 10 more this month. You can order between now and March the 14th. 
on the 15th is when I will mail out. If you order between now and the 14th, you will get this month's uh, box, which comes out March the 15th. Or if you pay on the 15th and up to the next month, then you will get the next month's box. Okay. I may have a thing where you can go back and buy the last month's box, if you will, or club kit. That way, those that come in later that may want it can get it. <clears throat> they could be um, Norella, but I decided to hotspot because of that. So let me see what Henry says. He just messaged me. Now, I turned off the internet on my, but let me go try something. Okay, hang on, y'all. I'll be right back, okay? I'm going to try something. Thank you, Ellen, for your donation. Okay, sorry. I just made a change, so maybe it'll be a little better, but I'm hot spotting. So, okay. Okay. Are we better? I hope we're better now. <clears throat> I hope it starts working. And it may end up that I have to disconnect and start again. Let me know if it's working better. I'm so tired of internet issues. I hope I can fix it. But I'm glad I got a month free. <laughs> Okay, Sandra. Okay, so it seems like it's not working. Henry says it thinks it's better. If you're still buffering, refresh and see if that helps. And someone that isn't buffering, type that. Say, um, refresh if you're buffering, please. Yeah, Junkie Joe, if you type words together with a period, it thinks you're trying to post a link, and so then he yells at you. <laughs> so don't take it personally if you're a fast typer and you end up not having a space with your period. <laughs> With the with this kit here, Christine, it should there should be one if the drop down that you pick it says kit with printed kit and printed. That's what you're looking for. Okay, so it's buffering for you too. Kathy says it's better. It's better there where Christy is. All right, well, I'll just keep, I'll try to work as quickly as I can, at least cutting up the stuffs. You could, y'all could put on some music and I can pretend I'm dancing to it. <laughs> you know, I think when, the, when I post videos, I don't know if anybody can say, answer this, I have noticed that it, won't have all the buffering issues when it's recorded but maybe every once in a while it's usually not real bad when i've seen the recorded ones okay 
And Norella, we've decided that if you're still here, um, that you can uh, use the other side. So when we do a two-sided one, we may need to make sure that we strategically leave enough space that when you use the other side, you get some of the print. <laughs> Just saying. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all, that it's buffering. That makes it no fun. You haven't had any trouble with the recordings, Deborah? I didn't either. I thought they were working pretty good. <clears throat> I don't know why that the buffering keeps happening. And I don't know if it's both my internet and YouTube, because YouTube, I could not get on at all, even on my cell phone with YouTube. Dee Dee is here! Hey, Dee Dee! Well, I apologize that we're buffering. It happens. Um, oh, yeah, you know what? I need to have a raffle, y'all. So why don't we do that? And then that way we can um, keep going. Oh, y'all are going to love this. So, oh, let's do these. So I made these two journal cards Saturday. And let's do a raffle for that. So I'm going to put up the stuff. So give me a second. I will persevere to the end, Julie Parker says. <laughs> All right. Just do this. And let's put... Um, All right. Okay, so I'm going to open the giveaway. So raffle... And you're gonna you're gonna win this, okay? I'm gonna give y'all some journal cards that I made. This is using the Bella Rose, and this is postscript collage, and that is Lisa. So those are some stamps that I have in my shop. So raffle. Yeah, I think the recorded version, it may have a couple of hiccups, if you will, but I think for the most part it works pretty good. All right, I'm trying to get these cut up. I think I'm gonna leave that for now. I like to have all my pieces cut, so let's give y'all some background here. I requested from my guy that does my printing to get this to me on Friday so that I would have time to fussy cut at least a set before I go live and he said okay but then I never got it and I'm sending him a mess no Henry sent him a message about something else and he said I'm not gonna have it it'll be Monday before noon and I was like oh great <laughs> so I sent him a message I said I need that as soon as you can and it was later than I wanted it to be and I was having internet issues so I didn't get to cut one out and I didn't get two copies so I've got a buggy for another copy <sighs> that Lisa gets around I she does I like her because she's pretty all right so Oh, your printed is broke on orange. Okay, I must not have something enabled. I'm sorry, Christy. Please forgive me. I must have, I was trying to click on everything and I must not have had something enabled. So let me, uh, <laughs> let me see if I can fix it after I get off here. Oh, man. See, I kept having internet issues and I was trying to check. Did I dot here? Did I put the thing there? Did I put the shipping information? Did I remember this? And I kept, the internet kept going out on me. And I was like, really? <laughs> Please don't do this to me. Your slidey thing on your scissors broke? Aw, well that's too bad. I'm sorry. I don't know how. Maybe yours is a different model than mine.
Thank you, Christy. Thank you so much. I just, <sighs> I hate it when I do that and something's wrong and then I don't want to frustrate a customer because I know that I would be frustrated. But y'all have to know, I do this by myself. I mean, Henry feeds me. <laughs> I do the work. I do all the work <laughs> on the website and creating the products and negotiating with vendors to get products. And, you know, that's all me. <laughs> I do that by myself. <laughs> They're like mine. Well, I'm sorry yours broke. You know what? I bet you if you go to Fisker's website, because you said you bought those on Amazon, so you should have your receipt when you bought them, and I know it hasn't been a year, that if you message them, I don't know if email or if they have a website chat or something, take a photo of it and have it ready to send to them and message them. See if they won't fix it. They probably will replace them. You know, that's, I think, thank you so much, Sandra. Um, you know, I think a lot of companies, I've had a stencil I sent to someone and it broke. So now I've got to figure out if it's, you know, that was just a fluke or if I'm going to have a problem with the stencil material and I'm going to send her another one. I got to test it and then I'm going to send her another stencil because it broke. You know, most people are willing to do good customer service and replace or repair something. Um, and I'm, I'm just a little person, so it costs me if I, something breaks. That's I'm not Walmart. I can't just say, oh, that's part of the loss of operating a business. You just count that money in. Well, it costs me money when it disappears or breaks. <laughs> I, sometimes Henry cooks more than I do because he loves to uh, control what goes in his food. And I have a haphazard style of cooking <laughs> so I'll, I'll sometimes cook the steaks or pork chops or yes we eat meat um that kind of stuff and he'll do the sides you know or he'll do all of it just depends on how busy i am so i stay busy <clears throat> thank you so much dd Dee Dee. Thank you. Okay, Mariana, good. Dee Dee says Fiskers will replace them. And she said they had, she had a cutter that was warped and they replaced it. So there. Hey, Naomi. Oh, is he gone to bed now? I hope he feels better. I can't believe how big he's gotten. Naomi has a little one. and They were showing him walking around. He likes to cook, I think. Except when we're both like, I don't know. What do you want? Well, I don't know. <laughs> and sometimes I think I would just rather have food in a bag, you know, like Gogurt that has all the protein. And all I have to do is just squeeze a tube and be done. <laughs> that may sound weird, but sometimes food is such a problem. <laughs> yeah, if you haven't entered the raffle, enter the raffle. We're going to give away some journal cards. Okay. Raffle! Oh, my paper moved. Oh, I'm sorry he had a rough night. I hope he feels better. That's no fun. Vegan pink rose. So, what is your favorite thing that you like to eat as a vegan? What is it that you like? That's uh, that's really yummy, and I know, isn't that terrible, Fluke? I just astronaut food, exactly, Kathy. <laughs> meal, meal in a sachet. <laughs> Taco truck down the street. That's what we do, Dee Dee. It's bad. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's just kind of like, ugh, what do I need to eat? This is terrible. And I guess that's what, I don't want to be that way. I like food, but I don't like to take the time to prepare it. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds really good, Julie. 
That sounds good. We'll do sausage like that. We'll do sausage um, links is what we call them. Like a, We call it Polish sausage here, Julie. Um, and we'll do onions and peppers. And sometimes he'll put uh, mushroom in it. Just depends on what we feel like. And we'll do bell peppers is what we'll use. Or sometimes he'll use a poblano pepper de-seeded. And then I like, um, we'll do zucchini squash and yellow neck squash with onion and grill it. <clears throat> Your husband cooks. That's funny, Naomi. <laughs> army food. I used to eat the, M the MREs is what we called them when I was in the army. And... They really weren't that bad. I mean, we lo we missed real food when we had to eat out of them, but they weren't that bad. I mean, it was edible. Sometimes you were like, we need a little more seasoning or something, but for the most part, they're pretty good. Vegan tacos are great. So what do you use as your uh, protein or meat substitute in a vegan taco. I'd love to know. All right. See you later, Norella. Thank you again for your beautiful work. I just love it. Yeah. See, I, Henry, Henry does pretty good. If he tells me what he wants, I'll happily go in there and cook it. But he's always like, just cook whatever. I'll eat anything. And I'm like, sorry, I'm not inspired to go cook. <laughs> I have to be inspired to make journals all day. I can't be inspired <laughs> by for cooking. <laughs> beans. We like to use uh, black beans a lot. Henry, we still eat meat, but Henry will mix black beans with taco meat. And that way, he, I can kind of cut back on how much meat and get a lot more protein from the beans. Yeah, I actually had to eat MREs. They were awful. <laughs> they were okay. Yep, I was in the army. Not very long, but I was in the army for a little while. Bye, motel! That's what she said. <laughs> yeah, who invented kitchens? Oops. Uh, well, and you know, way, way back, the, the hearth of the home was in the center of everything. So you were in the living space. You had a cook fire and a warming fire and the tables were nearby and everybody came to the same space. The men would come and sit and chat and work on things around the dinner table until dinner was ready. And we don't do that anymore. We all have separate little rooms. And a person that has to cook hides in another room. Yeah, when you cook and you wish it was something else. Yeah, I, I understand that. Beans and other good things. Oh, yeah, Henry found some of those veggie packs. He found some um, broccoli, and it's really good. Okay, Christy, I'm sorry it wasn't working. She says she's ready. She's ready to buy. You're you're an your ex was a marine, okay? And lived army. I and army, gotcha. Some weird person. You were in the Air Force, Kathy? Wow, cool. It will be, um, Naomi, just has, I didn't get it uploaded yet today because I kept having internet issues, but it will be as soon as I get off here. 
I've got it all ready. It just wouldn't upload the files. So I could say, here it is. All right, so I fussy cut it all that. Do we want to do the rifle now? I understand, Sandra. And I'm not a picky eater. You like vegan burgers? I haven't tried a vegan burger. I'll have to try one. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to pick the winner of the raffle as soon as I figure out how to get there. There it is. Giveaway. And we're going to use a piece of paper and my pen. And these are for the uh, Bella Journal cards. Alright, I'm going to pick the winner. Pick the winner. The Luke! You won! And I think it's it's not Melissa. I forgot your name. I have your address. Winner! February 25th. Yay! Congratulations! Okay, so I'll pick something else. Alright, so this one we'll put right here. And what do I got? Oh, here we go. We've got some little envelopes. Alright, we'll do it again. I have Faluke's address, so that's all good. And thank y'all for your donations. I really appreciate it. Margie! I knew it started with an M, but I was like, what is it again? Margie! Thank you, Margie! I'm going to write that down. So every time I see you, I'll remember. Margie. I've mailed so many things out, and then I'm, I'm kind of behind on the Thursdays. I don't think I've mailed Thursdays yet. <laughs> I've been so busy. All right. So giveaway. Reset. Yes. Go up here. We're gonna. These are little designer envelopes. Open giveaway. So the raffle's open again. Raffle! I think we need $20 and then both journals can be auctioned off today. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. I have... Oh, I didn't get these cut out. I got one more thing to cut out. And then we'll start making this journal. I think I'm going to try at least make one different page other than the pages that are in the kit and then a couple of mop-up pages so you guys can see some stencil designs you're welcome you're very welcome margie i'm so glad i'm having fun with this i hope y'all are too i know some of my Prizes might be silly, but I thought, you know, if other people will use it, why not? I bought them because I like them, and then I didn't use them. So <laughs> I would start passing this stuff along because the, the room I'm in now is very, very full. And I need to organize and declutter some stuff. So I may start um, doing some decluttering videos where I just grab a bundle of stuff and do a video saying this is the bundle, this is how much it'll be, <laughs> and, and sell a few things that I, so I can get rid of it out of my room and not feel like that I have to do something with it immediately. Because that's where I'm at now. I feel like I need to start doing something faster and faster. And my, my time is limited, basically. Oh, thank you so much for your donation, Naomi. Thank you. Because um, I'm doing these kits. And then in between, I do something for Norella. Because I love her kits that, I, that she doesn't do exclusive food for me. <laughs> so, I, I don't have time for... Um, outside projects, if you will. Simplify! <laughs> it's freezing for you, Christy. It's been really windy today. I'll be glad when 
spring is here and you have those crisp days that give you some sunshine. I need to start working in my yard. I guess I'm going to have to start getting up at 5 a.m. <laughs> so I can go outside before it gets hot. <laughs> Margie says, when we look at our own stuff for so long, it gets boring and we need other stuff. Actually, I've been really good. I... Other than the supplies I'm purchasing for the kits that I've been making, I've really been good about not buying things. Um, usually it's something because I ran out of ink or I ran out of paint or I needed another piece of paper, but I'm not buying um, new embellishments or rubber stamps or hardly even any tools, really. I've been really trying to be good about using the things I have. Hard to get stuff in Australia. Oh, that's funny. She called her sons her tall marine and her little boy blue. Naomi asked the question. I probably missed it. Yeah, I understand. Just, you know, if there's something you want Naomi, we'll try to figure out shipping to you. Um, I know. Now, do you have to pay duty fees, taxes when it is shipped to you? I know some countries do. <clears throat> yeah, we're trying. I still need to get the note back from the uh, post office. I'm going to go in when they're not busy and see if I can talk to somebody in person. As long as it's flat. You know, what I'm finding is, like my stencil club, I can offer a pretty low rate on shipping because I'm shipping something flat in a normal size uh, business envelope. So the shipping is a little bit less. The subscription bought, stopped your extra buying. And do you feel happy about that? Because you're getting a box of goodies that are curated to all kind of go together. And that I'm, I'm giving you tutorials and we're walking through how to use those items. I know that the ladies that come to my workshop, they, um, they are finishing journals, you know, before they go home. So I know that they're using theirs. And I want to know about everybody else. You want the whole store, Naomi says. <laughs> uh, well, we'll, you know, we'll, let's, we'll chat. Let me see what I can do for you. Uh. Right, don't put the value on the receipt. You got it. And that's what I've done on on some orders because they ordered an add-on item. Um, the orders are split. If I try to combine them, I don't get a combined receipt. They're all individual. So sometimes I'll pick the receipt that has the least valued items on it to be displayed. It's in there. I'm not lying about what's in the box. I'm just omitting. <laughs> now, no, don't go running to the post office and telling on me, y'all. <laughs> the dollar changing is poo poo for sure. Thank you, Giovanna. Thank you for saying that. Thank you. You want that stencil? You like it? All right. This is in the stencil club. So let's let's uh, let's make some pages. Let's decorate some papers. Half price, half the price overseas envelope. I'll have to see if that is. Um, I've not heard that before, Dee Dee. Oh, good, Janet. I'm glad you like it. She says, I love doing the kits. They're all color coordinated for me. All right, so I'm just going to grab, I'm going to grab a yellow. 
Yeah, I'm going to grab a yellow. This is the yellow that was in the Bella Rose add-on kit. And I am going to get more of those. I've had a lot of people request the paint kits. Um, so I'm going to order more of those. And as soon as those arrive, they will be in my shop that you can buy them directly from me. Yes, this is the orange box. So we're having an orange Tattered Angels in this one. And this is an, my um, stencil that is for Stencil Club. So I wanted to show you the Stencil Club stencil first. So I did the orange. And now I'm going to do some yellow. And we're going to take another sheet of paper and mop up. So this is one of the stencils in the stencil club. So that's what it looks like when you mop up. Yeah, put in the raffle. Yay, I'm glad you like it, Becky. Yay. What do you think of that stencil design? I think it's gorgeous. Oh, good, Giovanna. I'm so glad. Okay, so that's one of the stencils in the stencil club. So let's do another one. This is the other stencil in Stencil Club. And I need your feedback. If you don't like these, I need to know. <laughs> if you love them, tell me. I understand if you don't have the funds, just, just let me know. So am I doing the right thing? Because I love how these are turning out. So I've laid the paper on top. And it's an 8.5 by 11 stencil. Okay. Sandra says, I love the kit, so I don't have to search for matching things. The Stencil Club is in my subscription area on my website, and you just sign up from now until March the 14th. Those orders will be sh shipped out on the 15th. If you join the Stencil Club on the 15th and after you will get the April stencil club but I'm if I get enough feedback I may see if you can um, choose an option to purchase a previous months but these will be only exclusive to the stencil club members these won't be in my shop for another 13 months is when I will add it to my shop you like that? Thank you so much. All right, so that is a couple of those pages. Let me grab. So now I've got some dictionary pages. And we're going to use the stencil that comes in the kit. So now you're going to see options, okay? Hey, Carol, I'm so glad you're here. You're, gonna, you're seeing the... Um, outrageous Orange. This is the next kit. Outrageous Orange. So, okay, then that's what I need to know what kind of size of stencils you want. I'm trying to make different varieties so that if you only want to use a portion of it, you can when you're working in a project. Um, you don't have to use the whole thing. I chose this size because I wanted to be able to add things. Oh, thank you, Becky, for your donation to journals without having to move a stencil around. Um, so that may be an option that I'll make like, a, you know, four stencils out of an 8.5 by 11. Thank you, Giovanna. Thank you. So this is the one that comes in the kit. What do you think of that? It's kind of psychedelic with the... Oh, good, Carol. I'm so glad you got it today. Carol just got the Bella Rose kit today. She's in uh, Canada. And so this is the other side. Do you like that? I don't know. I'm, I'm having fun with these, making my own. I'm going to put some ink on the back. You like that stencil? It's awesome. I think it's good. Thank you, Becky. Thank you, Christy. 
That would be cool. Yeah, you know, message me. I know that I've got one person wanting me to make a um, lace butterfly, and I'm not a very good drawer, so I haven't done that yet, but I'm working on trying to figure out how I can trace one, maybe. Um, so don't give up on me. <laughs> All right, so I did those. And I've got lots of those pages. I think we're doing pretty good. I'm going to dry these a little bit. You know, my subscription plus coffee. So when you got your box, it cost $57.50. So Julie, now... Is that because of what was listed on the front of the receipt? Because maybe what we need to do is always have you order an additional item. <laughs> and I put everything in the box and we just list that additional item on the cover. I don't know. Yeah, I knew that you were having to do pay for the, the taxes. Thank you, Janet. You like it, Beverly? I, I think it's turning out really cool, what we're getting. And I just love the colors, the little elements. Oh, there's the Stencil Club link, y'all. It just posted. Junkie Joe just shared it. Some bees. Thank you, Pink Robin. Oh, yeah, the raffle's still going. The raffle's still going. Thank you so much. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I think we're going to put... I like... Do you like those pages? I like them. Oh, all pentagrams? You know, if y'all have a, really want me to do those, send me a, um, you like the orange? I did a little bit of yellow with it, but yeah, the orange and the yellow is beautiful together. Send me a message on my website. You can use the chat feature or the contact me here and tell me what you want stencil-wise, and that'll give me some ideas of drawing things out and see what I can get. All right, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to make a pocket. So I'm just going to take this 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper and fold it up. And I want to make sure that this top edge is going to be okay and not tear. Oh, thank you, Mariana. And I'm folding it over to the, the inside here. And then I'm going to do the same over here. I'm just fold it backwards. I just fold them both at the same time so it kind of creases it. Okay, and then I'm just going to grab some glue and glue this. Yeah, sometimes the weight costs more, and that could be it. I tried to put all the... I know that when I shipped your box, not your box, it was another one. I shipped one to Japan, and with her add-on items, they cost shipping wise was about ten dollars more than she had paid for shipping but because she had so many add-on items i just pretended she got a discount if you will <laughs> because she's a really good customer i'm trying y'all i'm trying to get cheaper ways and okay well good maybe they will tell you Posted, postage mark stencil. So that's a possibility. I know that um, Beverly has a postmark stamp that I'm getting ready to add to my shop. And I think if I got that image, I can turn it into a stencil. And then they would match. And it'd be really cool to have that option. Okay. You bought the heavy things. You, yeah, the paint. <laughs> Thank you, Sandra. I'm trying, y'all. 
I'm trying. Thank you, Sandra. Okay, so there's going to be a pocket there. And what I'm going to do is I'm lining up the page in here. Do you all understand that, how I'm making a pocket? And I'm laying this down, holding it in place. I'm going to take some glue. Five dollars left, ladies and gents. Fairy wing stencils. Oh, that would, send me a message from my website. Really, I'm serious. So that because when the chat's over, I don't go back and look on the chat here. <laughs> but I'd love to remember those so that I can make them for y'all. Okay. Posted stencil. <clears throat> Fairy stencil. Oh, oh, yeah, and you bought the stamp bundles. Yes, you did. I hope you like all of it. I hope you're having fun with it, Julie. Thank you, Carol, for your donation. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're going to raffle off um, this journal, and I think we're almost to well, my goal of $75, and I will also raffle off the Far East Charm Journal when we get there, okay? Cross stencil, Janet says. Oh, a postcard stencil. Yeah, see, that's what I think, Beverly. That's what we should do. I think you should send me that image, Beverly. <laughs> wings, yes, wings. And I think um, there's a couple of your wing stamps that would make really cool wings. Cats. I do have a cat stencil. I may, I may reactivate it so you can see it. Mermaid. Buffering. All right, so I'm going to fold this up. Christy donated two dollars. Yay! Okay, so now that means we have gotten to my goal. So thank you so much. And those that have donated are eligible when I get to that point of being able to win. If you want, thank you, Sandra. If you want the opportunity to win the journals at the end you can donate any dollar amount it can be a dollar it could be twenty dollars whatever your budget allows you can donate okay all right so i took one of the other pages as you saw and i cut it in half so when i'm doing this journal i'm generally using eight and a half by eleven journal uh oh i'm broke Let's give it a moment, give it a moment. I'm just gonna sit here and sing. Right, Julie. I don't know if you're buffering where you are. Yes, it will stay. If it was with the main kit, you'll keep getting it. Oh. Okay, are we still buffering a lot? Refresh, everybody. I think it's YouTube because my internet here looks really good. I think it's YouTube. Two. Two stencils are in the stencil club. But you, and that's this one and this one. And then you get a 20% off coupon to buy every stencil that you want. All right. Let me. I don't think I can change anything. Oh, 
I'm still broken. <laughs> All right, I'm trying to answer your question. Deborah Carver's down for a donation. I see it. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your donation, Deborah. Thank you. <clears throat> All right, let me. I'm gonna. Seek several times now. Oh no, it's like stuck in a loop. That's terrible. Oh my goodness. I'm just going to keep going. Oh, her live was all jacked up. It completely jacked up. Well, the chat was current, to, but the video started over from the beginning. Wow. Thank you, Deborah. Okay. Hopefully, you'll get this. The raffle is so you can win this right now. And then, if you donate money, I'm going to give away the journal I'm making. And then, I'm going to have a separate raffle for this journal. So, I've got two uh, raffles that are for those that donate money. And then, everybody else gets to enter the freebies. It stops buffering. Oh, how funny. <laughs> oh. Well, bear with me. If you're if you're buffering, if those of you that aren't buffering, entertain your friends and say, just hang on. It might start working in a moment. <laughs> and right now all I'm doing is I'm folding the piece of paper. Make sure y'all enter the raffle. Uh, folded a piece of paper. And then this is going to become a pocket this way on our pages. What do you think of that? So I'm going to do that to this side. Okay, thank you, Carrie. Will do. Will do. Okay, thank you, Henry, for sharing that. Thank you, Giovanna. Thank you, Naomi. You like that idea, for, uh, Margie? I don't. I keep calling you the wrong name, <laughs> Margie. So that's gonna go here and here. So I'm just gonna glue these pieces. Seems okay now. We're starting to work again. I thought if we waited just a little bit. Did Carrie donate today? I don't see. Yep, I do. Okay, so when we get close to the journal raffle, Naomi, will you send Carrie a message to hop back on? Because she has to be in it to win it. <laughs> Hopefully we won't have any more uh, buffering. Okay. Thank you, Julie. I thought I was just going to keep going. Just keep going. Persevere. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Oh, there's different times. Ah, gift. Okay, so it needs to say a gift. Well, thank you for telling me that, Debbie, because I can do that. I can say it's a gift. I can do that if it helps people. Keep on going on. 
Okay, I'm glad. I'm glad, Carrie. I thought it was just probably like a, a surge, you know, of badness for a moment. Okay, so I cut those. Did everybody get entered in the raffle? Everybody get entered? I know, a lot to do. All right, so I'm going to do the, there's the butterfly um, bundle. You need to see that link. So now I'm just putting glue up the sides or what would be the top and the bottom. I'm folding that in. No, it does not make postage cheaper. If you're in the UK, it's expensive. Oh, I'm sorry, Carrie. That would suck. No, it's not cheaper to ship to the UK. I wish there was a magical way to get it there. Because <laughs> I'm in uh, the Yukon, Oklahoma, USA. Alright, so I'm getting this one put on here. Did everybody get entered in the raffle? Entered in the raffle. No, it's expensive to ship to the UK. I think one of my packages was um, $24 that I shipped. But she bought a bunch of other stuff too. Because the cost of shipping was like the base box was one price, but I could add quite a bit to it, and it wouldn't change the shipping cost. You're watching on your tablet? Yeah, see, I don't use PayPal because of people trying to send money, friends and family, or, you know, I've had some fraudulent stuff on PayPal happen to me in the past. So people keep saying, do PayPal. And I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry. I have a bad experience with that. But you can get a card on PayPal and you can use your card to pay. And it will come from your PayPal account. <laughs> That's what I've been telling people. Because that costs me too. When, when I take a hit, on a bad credit card or something, then it costs me. Oh yeah, she probably needs to download an app on your, um... yeah, yeah, Carrie, just twitch your nose. <laughs> yeah, Deborah says she watches the video on her TV and then opens the chat on her tablet. Yeah, you've had bad experiences too. Your PayPal, your card is on PayPal. See, and there's some people that do that. And I'm like, shoot, do that. If you like PayPal, use, your, use their card connected to the account. All right, so what I'm doing now is taking the staples out of the center. I was going to bring a staple puller in here and I forgot. So I'm using my scissors. Don't try this at home. <laughs> oh, no. Well, you should be able to open it from the store. I understand. If you said it's a Samsung tablet, I had a Samsung. Now I've got a, um, a new iPad Pro. I still can't figure that thing out sometimes. All right. So. Okay. I've got the cover. And then I put the pages where I think I want them. But I think... I want that in the center. 
Or do we want that in the center? Let's do that in the center. Okay. So I'm going to do one of these. Oh, I may do the other card in the, the other in the center. I know what I'm going to do. When it donates, ask your PayPal is attached to your um, YouTube or Google account. I I have technology problems too, so it's I'm still trying to learn how to use my iPad. Oh, how weird! So it won't let you use PayPal. Will it let you use a PayPal card? Maybe that's what the solution is, is to get the PayPal card. I had the PayPal card years ago, years and years and years ago. And like I said, we had issues with it, and I was like, okay, this is ridiculous, and I got rid of it. All right, so I have went ahead and I put some of the pages in here. You can add more if you want. In fact, I'm going to do one more thing. I've got a gel print here. And let's add a gel print to it. What I'll do is I'll make, I'll glue them back to back. And then that'll make a pocket. So I'm going to glue, I'm going to glue the edge over just a little bit. Okay, let's do that again. You're lost. Wrong center, Peak Robin says. Don't use that center. Well, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this in the center. I'll show you. All right. So all I did was I lined up all my pages, and I started to enter them into my journal. And then I thought about this gel print that I made. And so I've got two gel prints, and I have folded over the edge, okay? Oh! <laughs> Thank you so much, Gary. That's funny. <laughs> it's like, oh, it's okay. All right, so I've got these two back to back, all right? So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put glue down the side and across the bottom and back up the other side. Okay? And then I'm going to put these back to back, if you will, with the pretty side out, like so. Ah! Amazon does not take PayPal. See, yeah, you got to wonder if Amazon doesn't take PayPal. You like the gel prints? Okay, so now I'm going to take this and fold it in half. And then, how about if I put that in the center? Does that make everybody happier if that's in the center? I think that'll be good in the center. And then we can put stuff on that. And we've added another page. Okay. Sound good? Well, we're going to, we'll decorate it. Let me get the, let me get the journal put together so we can get this done. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to just do the uh, pamphlet stitch. You know, sometimes I would alter my stitch marks to come down a little bit if I'm working with a smaller piece of paper. And I know that I want it to catch, especially in the center of the journal. So I'm going to go ahead and punch right dead center. And then I'm looking at this. I think I've kind of got it marked. So we're going to put one there. And we're going to put one. I'm just eyeballing it right about there. I 
there we go. All right, so now I'm going to do the three times the length of the journal. And actually, it won't probably need that much because my holes are closer together. I have three pairs of scissors laying out here, y'all. <laughs> Thank you, Giovanna. You like that? You like the orange? Okay. So we're going to start in the center. We're going to go to the top hole. Back out to the center. I'm going to hold this up. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Did I show? Wasn't it you that sent me the package? I need to say that again, huh? <clears throat> and then you make sure these are tight. And then I'm going to tie this off. Okay. All right. Then I'm just going to cut off the extra. And then I'll put my tools away. You like it a lot? Yay! S scissors in a sub box. You know, I'm 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 looking for a good price on scissors that I can offer y'all. And oh, thank you, Kathy, for your donation. And then you know, remember I have these little junk journal tools uh, bags in my shop as well. And it's so handy because then all the tools are right there, and I don't have to worry about them. All right, so let's see here. went across there. Okay. We've got my fibers. So I'm going to get out my fibers and I've got some washi tape here. I've got some lace. So let's decorate this little journal, okay? Yeah, I should be able to. I just, they, they have a, a requirement how many you need. I did make a journal card before I came on here using the Bella Rose and the orange Tattered Angels and the orange cardstock. All right, so let's see here. We've got, this can be a tuck spot type thingy. So I need my Distress Ink out. And then we've got these little pockets here. So let's start grabbing a couple of these and putting Distress Ink on there. You use the Tim Holtz snips and cutter bees. I I narrowed my scissors down. I don't have as many as I used to of different brands. Um, I have the Fiskars brands. Here's my other pair of Fisker brand. These are all the same scissors. Um, and then I have a larger pair of Fiskars in here. And that's it. Well, here's a cheap pair. I got a really cheap pair of scissors in here. When I want to cut something that I don't want to ruin a pair of scissors on. You like the orange? I thought that would be pretty. That's the Bella Rose. Genovana just loves orange. Well, I'm glad that this is being showed today for you. <laughs> Again, this is not a subscription. It's just a creative box representing one of the colors of the rainbow. The next rainbow box will be yellow. Will be yellow. Oh, we're buffering again. Yes, I paint the roses with glimmer mist. Well, I'll just sit here and put the Distress Ink on the Fussy Cuts. For Thursday, I'll have all the stuff cut out because I have a kit now. <laughs> so y'all won't have to wait on me to cut it out. And you won't have to wait on me to put Distress Ink on any of the elements. I'll go ahead and have it all done. Okay. You want it, Naomi? I I think it looks really good. I I don't know. I'm really impressed with it. Okay, so let's kind of put this out of the way. Let's go in and start decorating our pages. So we've got 
little images here and there. I like to try to sort all the stuff to see, okay, what's a journal card? What's a, a word or something like that? So I know what I have in my kit um, when I'm putting it together. You know, I think it makes it easier to kind of ga gauge where you want to use something. And I haven't cut those out, so we're good. Okay. So I think let's start right here. And I think that would look kind of cool on that page. What do y'all think? You have to be Robin today. Thank you for reminding me, Giovanna. Okay, we're going to do the raffle. <laughs> You're changing how you feel about these different colors. Isn't it amazing? You know, it may not be the color that you would use or pick, but once you see how it comes together, you're like, hey, wait, I like this. All right, so do the raffle, and then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick. <laughs> oh, no. It's too hot for YouTube. <laughs> Wow. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll do that. Okay. Early birthday card present. Oh yeah. Um, I had to say this. What am I? Yeah. Deborah. Thank you. Thank you for the, um, I don't think you were here when I shared this. Thank you for your thank you gift there. Uh, Deborah. I don't think I told you that earlier. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we're all entered in the raffle now. All right, <laughs> exclamation point raffle, exclamation point. See that? It's an exclamation point. <laughs> so Becky, fix it. <laughs> all right, so let me, I got my notepad. All right, we're gonna pick. Gonna pick. I'm gonna type that out. I don't know how fast that goes. Gonna pick now. <laughs> We're the hottie friendly crafters. Woohoo! Helen says, draw already. <laughs> I did show it. Everybody loved it. Thank you so much. You did a beautiful job. Raffle! Raffle time! Okay, so we're gonna say pick winner. And it was Carol Jaggers. Carol, I have your address. I mail stuff to you all the time. <laughs> and you get the tags. Where'd you go? Um, envelopes. All right. So let me pick one more thing. We'll wrap another thingy off while I'm working on the journal. So how about, let me see what, I, oh, I got two of these. Okay, so how about if I do this raffle? These are going to be little ladies that I hand colored and cut out, fussy cut out. And then this is a card that I hand colored as well. So, yay! Yes, you do, Carol. You win every once in a while. So, congratulations. All right, so we're going to reset it. And these are going to be stamped images. Open giveaway. So, I'm going to do another giveaway of those stamped images, okay? So, the raffle's still open. Okay? Raffle! You see that? Raffle! Okay. So I'm going to glue this down right here after I add some distress ink to it. <laughs> so, dinner, dinner can wait. Dinner can wait. All right, we're going to put that on there. Like that. I could have left that as a card, but I decided that I want it to be a corner there. Mm -hmm. Let's put that corner there. Enter the raffle again. And you will win some stamped images that I have colored. And then you can make fun of me on the way that I colored them. 
I'm not in there. <laughs> See you, Connie. Thanks for coming. All righty. Let's see here. Let's see what we can put on the page. Okay, we'll put this one down here. I need to get the rubber stamps out too, huh? <clears throat> Let's put this ticket on there. YouTube sucks. Hi, Patricia. You're crafting along? I'm working on the Outrageous Orange. This is the second color of my Rainbow Creative Boxes. Kick the cable guy! Kick the cable guy! Say, listen, dude, this is not working. Yeah, I'm hoping that after they fix whatever's going on in my neighborhood, I will have better uh, internet. I think we're going to put this on here. trim this off okay not quite straight we gotta get it straight we'll add some distress ink to it are we still buffering let's see so I'm adding some of the fussy cut items from the outrageous orange subscription box to sprayed pages Mariana wants to kick YouTube. All right, get in the raffle. Get in the raffle. Kick the YouTube. Say, it's not cool, man. It's not cool. Buffering day. Buffering day. Okay. Let's get a rubber stamp out. Mm. Let's see. I think that one will work. I'm getting my ink out. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of people live. Yeah, the ads, um, I don't know. I, I try to turn it on where it's only supposed to do the ad at the end of the video, I think. Maybe at the beginning and the end, but not in the middle. So maybe I need to check those settings. Because when I went live today, it was acting weird. So this is the littlest butterfly in the butterfly bundle. So I thought it would look kind of cool. To just add it on the page. I may add one in here as well. So we're just kind of adding a little whimsy, if you will. Maybe we'll put one right here. All right, Rita, thanks. It's been kind of coming and going. <laughs> All right, so let's see. If I put that here, then that can be a pocket. I don't know what NBN means. I didn't see it. Oh, it's a type of internet connection. Is that something you have where you are, Naomi? Gotcha. I was like, I don't know what it is. I think I'm going to make this a little corner tuck spot. And that'll go right here. Okay. 
Okay. And then I'm going to use my, you know, Dee Dee and them were saying they wanted a scoreboard. And I'm like, I don't use a scoreboard. I use my cutting board to um, score. So I line everything up with the cutting area. Oh, I, I didn't have a good uh, grip on it. And I'll score in here. And that seems to work better for me than trying to use the scoreboard because they have a tendency to have a mind of their own, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> and usually even with bumpy stuff I can figure out how to score it you want a stiff drink <laughs> yay I'm so glad Deanna yay Julie needs a coffee. Go get a coffee. Go grab a coffee. A mocha caramel Xanax latte? Who's making those kind of lattes, I wonder? <laughs> oh. Oh, it's, it did it on Friday? How weird. It took it a few days to process, I guess. You know what? Hmm. I'm seeing something here. Okay. I'm going to try something with this little pocket. I may have to tell Norella to make a little change to this if my idea works okay all right so here's what i'm going to do i want to overlap these just a little bit i'm going to really score and press this down so hopefully it'll stay together and what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue this tab right here in the corner together and hold it for a second and I may even add another little piece here let's do that I can add that on there so I'm going to give that some weight and I'm going to make this a little tuck spot inside this little folder looking thing if I can get the glue I may have to use the best glue ever that's what I'll do I'll use the best glue ever it'll stick to this shiny paper oh yeah raffle do I need to do that I haven't I haven't done the doll raffle yet all right so I put a little bit of the best glue ever on there and I'm going to let it air dry for just a moment. And then I'm going to put just a little across the corner of that so it can dry for a moment. And then we'll put those together. Yay! Fur babies. <laughs> Get in the raffle. It's for this little doll, two doll, paper dolls, and this little uh, goldfish. These are all hand painted by me, yeah, watercolor, or my markers. I can't remember. I think those are watercolor markers. Okay. So we did that. Let's put this one in here okay so we've got this little bit sticking out here so let's put that on here I think we'll do a darker yeah the lighter on the darker
Enter the raffle. Okay, let me put this down here. So you can write on that if you want. And then in theory, wait, I may need to save that one. Yeah, I think that's the one I need to save. Okay, it goes there. This can fit in here. Oh, we need to put some distress ink on it. Oh, the the Oscars were last night? I didn't even know. I didn't watch. I'm going to put that there. It was upside down. Okay, that's the dead center. So let's put a butterfly across there. Oh my gosh, that's a big cat. A 25 pound man coon. Oh my goodness. It's well loved. <laughs> it must not like the word. Okay, we got that there. Let's put this. Let's put this on this side. And then we'll put the journey on this side. Yep. <clears throat> what else we got? Buffering makes me miss. I won't. I'll wait. I'll wait. <laughs> Were you just typing funny stuff, Kathleen? Were you just typing silly things, leaving a Z? You're just dropping the Z here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Alrighty. So let's put a birdie over here. How's that coming together, you think? All right, I'm not keeping up with the chat at the moment. I'm going to try to hurry and finish this journal so that y'all can move on from buffering, buffering. <laughs> All right, we'll put this down here. Let's put some butterflies on here. Butterflies. I like the butterflies. Do y'all like the butterflies? I hope you like the butterflies. Okay, so this is almost dry. Still um, not quite clear yet. So we're going to wait just a little bit longer. And I think I'm going to make this a tuck spot. So we're going to put on the top and the bottom. And I'm going to tuck them in just a little bit from the edge. Okay. Yeah, the buffering is YouTube issues. Yeah, I'm, I'm not even with the comments. It's kind of weird. Okay, so we're going to put that there. Let's put Dragonfly. Refresh, see if it makes a difference. All 
All right, we're going to put this on here. I'm not quite happy with it yet, but I think that'll look good there. I don't, it hurts when you lose a pet. They're so, um, so de near and dear to our hearts. And then when we lose one, it hurts when you've made them part of your life and you miss them terribly. I know, I've missed quite a few animals over my lifetime. Well, keep, keep refreshing. Maybe it'll start working better. I love these elements that Norella made. You know, using my stencil design as her background. I think it looks amazing. She did a really good job with that. Put that down here. Vibrant. Okay. So we just have a few little thingies left. So let me kind of flip through here and see what I can add ah here we go a couple more little oh that goes with this put this one over here okay like that hercules is good he went to the shop today the little stinker he didn't want to stay here with me he wanted to be with Daddy, so he left me. So I'm here by myself today. If somebody come through the door, I wouldn't know they were here because he wasn't here to bark and protect me. <laughs> 20-year-old lab. That is an old lab. They don't usually live that long, so that's amazing. Okay. So I'm just adding Distress Ink to these journal cards. And I think I want to make a couple more journal cards to go inside. And then I'm going to draw for the little ladies. And do y'all want me to draw for the Asian journal first? And the way that's going to work, hopefully we're not buffering. Um, okay, I am. Do um, you want me to do the Asian raffle while I finish the little cards that I'm going to make? If you want me to do that first, then we'll raffle that one first, okay? So we're going to pick the winner of these. And then if you want me to do the Asian raffle, because we know what it looks like, it's finished. And only those who have donated money can enter when I do the journal raffle. So here's what I've done. I've got the best glue ever down here. And then there's the best glue ever on here that's dry. I'm sticking it on that. And then this journal card goes in here. Like that. Isn't that kind of cute? And I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take a little piece of string. Do, do, do. There it is. And I'm going to tie a bow. Yeah, so that if you've donated money, you can be entered to win. I'll do the Asian journal first after I pick the winner of the dolls. Um, if you want to have a chance to win, donate any dollar amount. Oh, thank you, Pam, for your donation. You can donate any dollar amount, and then you can be in the raffle to win the journals. You know, I'm going to have two separate raffles for the journals. Okay. Isn't that cute? I thought it would be kind of cute. I'm going to put that right here. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to pick the winner of the little girls, my pen, 
And we're going to do giveaway, and we're going to pick a winner. Erica Nelson! Erica won! I think I... Did I just mail something to you, Erica? <laughs> uh, paper dolls and goldfish. Okay. Now, does everybody understand the rules of the next raffle? I want to make sure that everybody understands the rules for the Far East Journal So I put in only those who donated can enter, and I'm going to read off the list of those that have donated. And if you donate before I um, pick the winner, then you have a chance to still win. So all you have to do is donate. So I'm going to read off who is in the list, and then I'm going to start the um, raffle. So one moment. So we got Pam, Kathy Lake. Deborah Carver, Sandra Louise, Christy Evelbell Johnson, Carol Jagger, Sandra L., Mariana, Pink Robin, Becky Sportslander, Naomi, Ellen Smith, Giovanna, Paper Puddles, Christy Everbell again, Robin Stapp, Debbie Abu, uh, Zanhart, Zanrit, 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 uh, Naomi, and then Felique, or uh, that is the same as Margie. All right, so only those who have donated can enter. So I'm going to type that again. Only those who have donated may enter. Okay. And then I'm going to start that raffle. I want to make sure everybody understands. So we're going to open that up. And only those who have donated can now enter to win. Okay. <laughs> Good, Leslie. If you enter and your name is drawn, I'll just pick another winner. If you don't donate, oh well, sorry. You can donate any dollar amount, though. Just remember that. All right, so I'm going to make a couple of quick journal cards here. So let me grab, so I've got some little pieces of paper. And I love the way that Norella did this, where she um, you made the border on there with the stencil. So let's do something a little similar. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to lay this in my box. And I think what I'm going to do, oh yeah, that'll look cute. Won't it? Won't that look cute if I center that on top of there. All right, so I'm doing some creative masking, okay? All right. So those that have donated, and when I go to draw the winner, I have to verify first. So now I'm going to use the orange through the stencil. I'm going to spray... I'm going to add a little bit of this yellow to it. I don't know. I just like the sunniness of it with it. And let's do, let's mop up a little bit. Just so we can use some of that. And then that kind of creates another. What do you think? Isn't that cool? All righty. And then, okay, you ready for the big reveal? Look at that page. So I'm going to pull off the note card and then look what it did on the journal card. Isn't that cool? All right, so that was, I made four cards in one spring. Okay, that was four cards in one spring. So I'm going to dig around in my paper bin. All right, so I got a couple more here. So that's, you know, the reason I'm showing you this is this is ideas that you can use your um, stencils with, okay? So now I'm going to turn them this way. 
in this way. And what I'm making now is I'm making a journal page that I can use some other time. But at the same time, I'm going to spray I'm going to add some of the yellow, okay, and I think we'll do, let's grab some more journal cards. Okay, I've got this size, so I'm going to put that size down, and that one down, and while they're down, I just want a little mist on the back. And then that's a journal card, and that's a journal card. Just that fast. And then we've got two more. So you get both effects, okay? So now we have journal cards. Has everybody entered the raffle that is eligible? I'm going to read off those that have entered the giveaway. We have Robin, Ellen, Felique, Sandra, Robin, uh, Pink Robin, Christy, Kathy Lake, Giovanna, Pam Emmons, Mariana, and Sandra Louise. So those have already entered. These people are still eligible. Deborah Carver and Carol Jagger, Sandra L., which I think Sandra donates on a different... She, she enters the uh, on one device and uh, donates on a different... We've got Becky Swartzlander, Naomi, you're uh, in it. Ellen, I think I didn't call your name earlier. Somebody messaged Carrie and say to uh, get in the raffle. Get in the raffle for the, um... you know, Christy, I, if you want to donate for someone else, um, what would happen is if your name is uh, comes up, then you have the choice if you want to give it to someone else. How's that sound? If that's something you want to do, you can donate in behalf of someone else. You give up your spot. Okay? So if you donated, then I should have read, read off your name. Uh, Margie, did you get in? Let's see. And Debbie and Naomi and Carrie. Okay? Mariana got in. Carol got in. Message Carrie. Okay, good job. I want her to get a chance at it. Okay, so I'm going to add some distress ink to the edges of these journal cards um, and make sure that we've got her. And then, Debbie, I think you have it wrong. You need to do it with the exclamation point and raffle. Okay. Oh, gotcha, Christy. Gotcha. Well, you donated already, so you don't have to donate again. I'm just saying that if I call your name, then uh, you can choose what you want to do, okay? All right, Deborah got into the raffle. So everybody entered in the raffle. Pink Robin. We're just waiting on... And I'm just doing it to be polite. Carrie, if Carrie's there. I understand the end of the month. <laughs> I understand that. We have a couple of vendors that sometimes don't pay us for three months through our embroidery shop. So there'll be some lean months, and then bam, we'll get a check. <laughs> it's like, oh, we can buy stuff again. <laughs> All right, I'm just kind of adding quickly to those, and I think that looks good. All right. Gotcha. Okay, I thought so, Sandra. I knew you were on two different devices, and so it looks weird when... You donate a one device, and then you enter the raffle on the other device. <laughs> All right. So I think I want to stamp. Let's get this other butterfly out. Oh, wait. Let's do this. Okay. So I'm going to stamp the butterfly up here. Okay. And then I'm going to get the...
Yeah, I understand. Social Security sucks. I I am blessed that while I worked, I did invest some money in a 401k. And Henry's been managing my monies since I no longer have a full-time job. And he has been able to grow my retirement. Plus, I get a pension when I turn 55. What do you think of that? See how quick that was? Kinky Joe is picking on you. <laughs> yeah, some businesses suck that. That's why I try to um, make sure that when I owe somebody, I pay them. I don't dilly-dally around about it. I try to go ahead and get them paid. All right, I'm going to do that again. I just like the way it looks. What do y'all think? Did Carrie come? Is she going to come back? The puddles come back and they join? Hey, Debbie Smith. You like the quote stamps? All right, so we got a couple of quote stamps there. So let's stamp the bigger butterfly on one of the bigger cards, yeah? You never knew how to use them? Well, there you go. You know, you don't have to, um, you like the butterfly stamps? Yay! You know, you don't have to uh, stamp and color every image. You can stamp and fussy cut out an image and layer it on top of another image. Um, I mean, there's all kinds of ways to use stamps. Oh, I like the way that one turned out. What do you think? You know, just have fun with them. And don't stress about them if they're not perfect. Because it makes it part of the charm. Alright, so we've got one more. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab a piece of paper. And we're going to line this up in the middle. Okay? So these are two lined... Um, Two lined cards, and I think I have one big enough. I think this will work. I'm getting a larger block. Yeah, I can't imagine living in a car for a year with a wheelchair. I, I, I that's we don't take care of our own. When they need help, it's rather sad. All right, so I've just put it in the middle of my block. I'm going to ink it up. And we're going to see if I can do this. Because I thought it would look kind of cool if I stamped it. And you get half on one card and half on the other. Cool. Yeah, bureaucracy. It's all about money. It's all about the mighty dollar. Dollar, dollar, dollar. All right. Well, um, I think Carrie, I think everybody's that's going to be entered is entered, right? For the Asian journals. Okay. So I'm going to, you like the giant butterfly? Good, I'm glad. I'm glad you like it. I thought it looks really cool. So you kind of see the different ones that I made. All right, so I'm going to type this out. I'm going to pick the winner of the Far East Charm Journal now. So I just want to make sure if, if you have donated money. Okay, she's probably busy. Don't worry about it. Um, we're going to get you entered, okay? You ready? All right. I'm going to take a drink. Now i got to find my notepad. All right. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to pick the winner. Pick the winner. Robin Stapp. You are the winner. Do I have your address, Robin? Robin, you're the winner. Robin. Ro 
Bob and Stab. Yay! Okay, do I have your address? If not, if you can message it to me, either on my Facebook or my website, Junkie Joe just put the links up there. I would greatly appreciate it. Put that over there. Okay. So, she knows she won. She knows she can message me. So, now what I'm going to do is, as I'm putting the journal cards in the journal, I'm going to set up the giveaway for the um, orange, outrageous orange journal. So, only those who have donated money can be entered to win. Um, and... I guess what I can do instead of refreshing the um, list because all of you that are here have entered already once, um, I can just pick a winner. So if you haven't entered and you are on the list of donating, please enter. Oh, she came in. <laughs> well, she's entered now in the last one. So go ahead, those of you who donated. Uh, enter again just to make sure that you're entered while well, I put some journal cards in this journal here and there. Okay. I saw this one. I thought that would look cute right there. Kind of gives it a background. Okay. So only those that donated. Yeah. I think it turned out pretty cute for having internet issues and whatnot. That's a tuck spot there. But this is what I'm going to put here. Actually, I'm going to put it the other way so it sticks out more. Okay. I'm going to put that one over here. And, oh, we've got an orange envelope. I forgot about that. We'll just put the orange envelope in here. Yeah, let me stamp on it. Okay. All of you that have donated money, are you in the raffle? What do you think? That looks kind of cute. This is for the Outrageous Orange Journal. And then I'll be back on Thursday, internet willing. And I will do another journal using the expanded kit. I'll probably also make a mini journal as well. And, uh-oh. They just glued. Oh, let's stamp a butterfly on here. Let's do it like this. We're going to stamp it off. So it's going to kind of look like that. Yeah? I think that's kind of cute. Don't you? Should I do that again on this side? And then let's do it over here. Ready for the drawing! Okay, so you, I think I have it, Robin. I'll look. But if you, wherever you messaged me before, if you'll message me again, I would greatly appreciate it. <laughs> you like it? Okay, thank you, Debbie. Thanks for coming by. Thank you. Gluing error. I fixed it. It's okay. Let's see if that will, yeah, it'll close. We got a journal card here. Got a journal card here. Got a journal card there. All right, so we need another two journal cards. So let's do four. Okay. So I'm going to make four more little cards, just like we've been making. See how that channel page, that journal page turned out? Isn't that cool? Oh, here, we'll just do it on this.
painting cards really fast. Oh my goodness, I'll see if I can give you some more, Carrie. I'll see if I can give you some more uh, junk books. Since you changed your name. I forgot when y'all do that, you change your name or use a different device, you get junk books. Uh, room numbers change. Alright, so let's put... Let's do this butterfly again. So now we got four little journal cards that kind of look alike. So they can be put wherever. Okay, so I'm going to put one right here. I'm going to go back this way and swap one in there. So I could put that there, one there, one there. All right, I think this has got, got some room for interpretation. Okay, is everybody entered? Is everybody entered? Are the donators entered? I don't think I spelled that right. Okay, so I'm going to flip through this again, and then make sure you're welcome. Okay, make sure you're all entered, and then once I get a few more yeses, then I'll pick the winner. And I'm going to flip through this. So this is the base journal that comes in the kit. This is one of the journal pages from the kit. I use the stencil from the kit. This is one of the elements from the kit. Um, <laughs> and then uh, this is a journal card. There's one of these in the kit, so you can make one like that yourself. Um, there's different sizes of journal cards that are in the kit, but this is one that I had. Dictionary page, copy paper. Okay, this was one that I made a few days ago and thought it would be cute in here. And then instead of making this just a pocket that was glued down. Remember, it's a little booklet, and I have a card inside there. So we have a dish, additional journal place. Okay. Naomi got entered. Becky. All right. So if everybody's in, so we can do the butterfly or the outrageous orange. I don't know why I said butterfly because I was looking at it. I guess. The other side, the butterfly. I love the the neon orange envelope. Do you like that? Y'all said you like this size of envelope, so I wanted to make sure that I put some in the kits. So I'm looking for more valuable. I love the way this turned out, too. Using the gel prints. Okay? All right, I think we're ready to get the winner of the raffle. Well, we got an empty spot here, but y'all can just... Here, I'll do this. I'll stamp it. This one will be plain. That looks kind of cool. It looks kind of botanical, don't you think? All right, we're going to pick the winner. Elijah! Oh, saying Bubba, Bubba, Bubba. It's Winnie Pooh, his Bubba. Uh, okay, let me pick the winner. Pick winner. Deborah Carver, you won! Deborah, you won! And I think... I have your address because it's on the envelope here. And I have it because you ordered stuff. Outrageous Orange won by Deborah. Congratulations. Woo -woo. Thank you. Thank you for your donation and thank you for being here. I like this too. The way this comes out. So, what do you think of orange now? Is orange not as bad? Especially when you pair a little bit of yellow, a little bit of green. You like it? Oh, wait, did I just... Oh, Deborah wants to give it to Les. Oh, well, thank you, Deborah. Okay, I can do that. Thank you so much, Deborah. You're so kind. Thank you for doing that. Give it to Les. Okay. <laughs> That is so sweet of you. Leslie, you still here? Make sure you message me. 
Yay! Well, congratulations, Leslie. You won a journal. You won a journal. You like it? All right, well, let me sign it. Um, and I'm going to get off here and eat some dinner and figure out why my shop won't let you pick the items in the drop down. You're very welcome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Not so bad, Sandra, huh? Good, yay! So I'll be back on Thursday. Feed us too, Christy. I'll get you, uh, here, let me push a button. Boop! <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. All right, go make some food, Margie. Make some for me. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, she's, I've got her address. She'll just message me. <laughs> Good night, Mariana. Thanks for being here. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, dear. There you go. Order in night pizza and Linda videos. <laughs> Uh, Linda Live. Henry Starving. Thank you, Giovanna. Thank you. Thank you so much, Carrie. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nobody cooks here. I understand. Thank you so much, Mariana. Love to meet you someday. Thank you, Robin. Chinese food. Ooh, that does sound good. Problem is, I gotta make sure I don't order stuff with a lot of carbs in it. <laughs> More of a stir fry. You will have to do it, Sandra. You're very welcome. Thank you. Well, Thursday it will go better. I I predict. <laughs> All right, y'all. You have a fabulous night. Thank you so much for being here being a part of my life. I really appreciate you. Check out my shop for anything that you saw here tonight that you would like for me to send your way. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. You can ask under this video. You can come to my website. You can go to Facebook. Okay. Much love, much love. Ooh, make pastrami sauerkraut and Swiss cheese sandwiches. I can't say that fast. That would be really good. You're very welcome, Carol. All right. Yeah, check it out. Let me know if you need something or help with anything. I know, Christy. Let me get off here and go fix it. <laughs> ah, you had that two nights in a row. You could go a third. <laughs> You like that pizza and videos, Naomi? <laughs> How funny. You're very welcome, Sandra. Thank you for being here. Coffee and cake. Here we go. Pepper chicken. Oh, that sounds good. Onions and pepper. That's pretty good. Yeah, I could do that, Carrie. Thank you for that. It's got <laughs> just chicken. <laughs> The meat will have to be plastic. <laughs> You're very welcome. <laughs> no problem. Junkie Joe just wants to pick on you, Sandra. <laughs> All righty. Well, I'm going to get off here unless y'all have another question or anything. Some dip. Thank you all again. Beef and broccoli. Oh, that does sound good. Beef and broccoli does. Hmm. That's, a, that's an option. All righty. Y'all have a fabulous night. Thank you so much. Thank you all. Ah. That does sound good, Naomi. Good stuff. Good stuff. Thank you all. Okay, we're going to get off here. Bye, everybody. Mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs>